Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about moving audio, which is Dolby Atmos. So define the process first. Uh, engineers now can, with these multiple channels in different room locations, place objects or sounds in those locations to make for a more dramatic, you know, presentation value to everything. It's good if the engineer's good. The engineer has a concept and an idea of the presentation value he's trying to achieve, it's good. If he's just throwing things in different channels, well, the results will speak for itself. So he has that ability to place these sounds in different locations. So lots of energy. So we have multiple channels, front of the house, sides, rear, ceiling now, height channels, full range, lots of mono sources in the room, lots of energy coming into the room. They're high resolution, there's multiple, and the room is always too small. I mean, eight foot ceiling heights, nine foot ceiling heights for ceiling speakers. Background music, okay, but full range at pressure levels that you're gonna play in a theater. It's just too low, too small, okay? So the speakers are gonna produce many zones or pockets, if you will, of pressure and reflections. So we have to manage all those. The more energy, the more pressure, the more reflection, the lower the resolution. So we, if we want to increase the resolution, we got to add a lot of treatment, much more than we do with two channel, okay? I could squeeze really good sound out of some front wall uh, low frequency management and some side wall reflection foam. You can improve the presentation value dramatically with just those three surface areas. Not with theater, not with moving audio and atmos. Okay. So coverage of treatment along with the performance. So we're going to need more treatment and it's got to have more horsepower. It really does because there's so much more energy. Multiple channels in multiple spots of the room. What if that location in the room is not good for a speaker placement? People with two channel systems fight that all the time, moving speakers around, trying to find the location. And that's two speakers. Can you imagine 11 trying to figure that out? So coverage of treatment has to be increased in performance. Rate level of absorption is critical for low frequency energy. So we're thinking about a new series of products just for theaters that has even more performance than our standard uh, Carbon technology, it's the same technology, we'll just punch up the horsepower, the rate of absorption inside the unit by making the carbon filter thicker. We're working on doing that right now with, without increasing costs. That's the challenge, okay? So we gotta get the reflections managed for speech intelligibility in the middle and high frequencies also. That's a critical situation. Moving energy at all room locations means we got to now double, quadruple our efforts compared to two channel. So we don't have two speakers, we might have 10. So the problems with two are multiplied by five. So you got you to gotta think seriously about this. Our series of videos on our multiple channel room that I have been in for the last 18 months will be out at Christmas. What I did there in that room was try to get the same resolution with eight channels as I do with four, or as I do with two. I was able to get pretty close, but not, you know, not the same. And I don't think it's possible because multiple channels produce multiple areas and locations of more issues. Two channels, you know, you can localize those issues. You know, the front wall is going to be a high pressure area. You know, the side walls are going to be reflection you know, issues that need to be managed. But think of that scenario that you go through in two channel, think of that in a theater where it's multiplied by five or 10 times. So even a higher need for treatment. And you can see in the, uh, the upcoming videos, the amount of treatment we have in that room. And uh, it's amazing. It's probably double and triple what you would have in a two channel room. Moving audio, Dolby Atmos, fun new format, but plagued with issues that you really gotta be aware of and take seriously when it comes to treatment. 
Hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions, and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum, and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.